Okay. All right, which one of your cats is in charge of Screety Polity? We got a complaint. Screety Polity. Whoa. Wait, what's going on here? Is this the winery dogs? I don't know Billy Sheehan sang. That's some seriously Leslie affected guitar. Tight. Sounds good. This is some, uh, some reserved Mike Portnoy. Whoa. Sounds like Big Wreck. Dear cameraman, you're making me dizzy. All right, some Dave Grohl style drumming going on here. solo. Professor Bluebeard on drums. Ooh, they're making us wait. Here. Whoa. Mark Knopfler. Oh, demented, demented guitar playing going on here. Foot cowbell, clave, non clave foot cowbell, quarter note cowbell. Whoa. Oh yeah. That was phenomenal. Oh, 
That was a really good guitar solo. That was definitely next level shit right there. Interesting harmonic choices there. Holy shit. That was that was really, really impressive. Man, that guitar solo was like that was that was on a whole nother level right there. Uh man, really really good chops, really amazing sound. That could that guitar playing was phenomenal. I'll tell you that right there. Do you hate to tell us? I hate to tell you, but Richie Cotson just took out the rest of the band right there. He just he just slaughtered the other two. They were good, but he was amazing. God damn. And his singing sounds like, what's his name? The guy who was uh, shunned by the music industry after that video. Billy Squire? <laughs> See, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> yeah. Singing sounded like Billy Squire. Guitar playing sounded like some other shit. That was, man, really good guitar playing. All I got to say is that guitar playing was phenomenal. Really, really good. A combination of sound, technique, and ideas. That's some of the best shit I heard in a long time. Wow. All right. Well, thank you very much, Mr. Cotson. Or is it Coatson? Whatever it is, you are forgiven, as Pete Townsend once said. Killing. Thank you very much.